All right. Go ahead and make this live. Go ahead and make a new playlist here. Let's see here. Pumpkin Jack. Pumpkin Jack. And make that public. Create. All right. So we're going to try out a new 3D platformer, which is not a phrase I get to say as often as I would like these days, but oh my god, I just love them. I, I love 3D platformers. My childhood, Spyro, Crash, which was more of a 2D, 2.5D, close enough. But spooky season, we got our Camp Crystal Lake shit up, brand new from uh, Spirit Halloween. Um, and we got a new spooky themed 3D platformer here to try out on PSN. I just randomly ran across this. I have no idea of its quality or review scores. Uh, but what the hell? We're going to try it out. So, without further ado, ba -ba -da -ba -ba, let's go ahead and start it off here. I got a big backlog to get through, and I want to try out a lot of horrifying games. I'm kind of excited for this one, though. I think it's going to be fun. We got our Disney Haunted Mansion graphic going in the back. I think this is going to be fun. Oh, we got skin selection. Ah, yeah, I'm not buying shit. <laughs> Let's see. Field of view, graphics mode, performance, or quality? Uh, let's go quality. We'll see if the frames are indecipherable. Let's check this shit out. Once upon a time, in the great Arkansas Kingdom, as you do, the world lived in peace and coexistence between the humans, the animals, the birds, even the cute little bunny rabbits. It was an age of prosperity you think those would be without the animals. anything to fear of war, By the way, we are drinking famine, Master of Pumpkins from Trogue's Brewing. Very boring. So boring, in fact, that even the devil himself was bored brainless. The devil dreamed of bloodshed, pestilence, suffering on a cosmic scale. So, he devised a plan to make things in Arkansas a little more entertaining. The devil unleashed the curse of the eternal night. A powerful spell that conjured mindless, soulless, heartless monsters across this the world. This seems a lot like medieval. The monsters lay waste to every city, every home, every leaky outhouse, and backwater town in the kingdom. It was beautiful, <laughs> but for some reason, the humans quite enjoyed their safe, boring little lives. They couldn't handle a few pesky monsters coming in and tearing them all You know, I'm kind of with the evil guy on this one. It does so, sound boring. they called upon their champion. Mighty wizard. A sorcerer with the skill and intellect to break the curse and usurp the devil's power. The wizard departed his luxurious tower in his studies to find the power he needed to break the curse of the eternal night. Very well, the devil said. Two can play that game. Hmm. And who knows? This might be the fun I've been looking for. So in response to the wizard's quest, he called upon a champion of his own. Stingy Jack. <laughs> history's greatest trickster and con artist. Banished to wander the world as a wayward spirit. What a terrible fate. The devil crammed Jack's soul just into the skin of a pumpkin. Stayed in hell. And made him a deal. The devil oh, would forgive Jack's past misdeeds and grant him passage to the after. And in return, he gave Jack one simple mission. Find the wizard. 
and destroy him. That doesn't sound so bad. Dad, there's a certain flutter in your chest at getting a new 3D platformer. I know people gave shit to ukulele, but holy shit did I have fun with that. Oh my gosh. Total death and destruction. Okay, circles roll. Makes us jump, obviously. We got the double jump. That's easy enough. So far, no attack button, but I'm guessing that's coming. Oh, man. This was a good choice. This is fall. This is Halloween. This is Halloween. What's up, Al? Of course, the owl's the servant of the desert. Ugh, desert devil. Jumping. Hello. Okay. I was already at full health. Wait, what's this? Hey. <laughs> wow. Crow skulls. Really. <laughs> This is fun. It's a little bit floating with the platforming, I can already tell. That's okay. I see a crow skull. Oh, yeah. Mmm, that's good collectible. was a short tutorial. All right, uh, I'm gonna grab another beer because I have a feeling I'm gonna keep playing this for a little while. And I'm also going to go to the bathroom, so we will be right back.
Master of Pumpkins, Pumpkin Jack. Why not? It's very thematic. Pumpkin, pumpkin, pumpkin. All right. Oh boy, we got obstacles. Hey, I think there's going to be a crow's head hidden back here. Hey, I was right. I'm an old school 3D platformer man. I know my way around in collectible too. Let me tell you, kids. I gotta tell you, though, these obstacles are incredibly avoidable. I mean, literally. I can just walk around them. Maybe not this one. That's not a crow's head, that's something out of bounds. Ba -ba -da -ba. Hello, crow. Death to the straw-faced menace. Now, I feel like that might be racist, but, you know, it's against scarecrows, so who gives a fuck? <laughs> Let's go ahead. Ah, oh, look at you. Look at you, Mr. Crow. Russell Crow. Hello, what's this? Copyright struck based on that. Well, that was fun. All right. You know, I, I've been playing for about five minutes. I think I'm already in love. It's amazing. Well, that's what she said. But, um... <laughs> It's actually amazing, like, how charming this is. It's so simple, and, and yet you can tell some real effort was put in. Oh, shit! I killed him! Yeah, fuck him up, crow. with these little practice dummies. What's going on there? I think there's a story. Hey, oh, fuck him up, too. Eh, maybe not. Okay. Let's just get the shovel and see what happens. Hey, what's this? Shovel face. Shovel face. <laughs> Fucking Edward Cullen. 
Hey, I can attack shit. Look at this. Yeah. Okay, so maybe I can't kill the scarecrow, but... Hell yeah. this? Ah, I thought that led somewhere. I will cut down these cornrows and sell them for ten dollars a piece. Freedom Farm Sandwich Shop. Oh, hell yeah. These useless collectibles are all mine. Yes. Mm. take fall damage, so that's encouraging. The soundtrack might get a little bit grating after a while. That's my first real criticism of anything. He's done. Skull breaker. Yes, yes. What's this? A merchant. Are there collectible upgrades to buy? This actually reminds me of Banjo Kazooie now with the fucking bird on my head. <laughs> I know he's on your shoulder before, but it's still pretty fucking similar. <laughs> Selling skins, then. Hey, what the hell? <laughs> Shut the fuck up, bro. <laughs> God damn it. I just made the exact same mistake, too. Oh, that was funny. <laughs> you know, fire burns things, right? Oh, hey. Don't be like that. Don't be hitting me. Pretty good dodge in there, I'm not gonna lie. I'm pretty fantastic. I think I see a hidden crow's head. Hello. Oh, 
Oh yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> crow's heads around here and can I just say selecting quality mode has not affected my performance at all okay, I know it's a freaking ps5 We're talking about a pretty generic looking 3d platformer but still it's like why select the other mode oh no Fuck. how dare you So water's an insta-kill. That is good to know. collectibles. I guess they're not totally useless. You can get a skin off of them. whoop de frickin' do. Give me one second, guys. Thank <laughs> you. 
Let's see just what the hell's going on here. So we've got, what, uh, 12 out of 20? Oh, hell. I did not know I kept count of the collectibles in the pause menu. That is a weird little quality of life thing that I actually really appreciate. actually a pretty terrible display and I apologize. Luckily, this game is pretty damn generous with its health. And I can just get it all right back by destroying random shit. Ah ah, my eye. Ah. Sorry. I'm not seeing any more crow skulls in this field. So let's go ahead and move on. Hello, Mr. Owl. fucking body and roll my head around. That's pretty interesting. Let's do that. Let's do that thing that they were just they were just talking about. <laughs> well, that's crazy, Morty. I, I, I'm I'm ahead, Morty. I'm ahead, and I'm not. I don't mean like I'm ahead in life. I mean like. I'm ahead in a race. I mean, like, I'm literally a head with a space in between. Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's good. Holy shit. That's cool. Oh. You just punch a lever to get it to go. Look at that! Look at that! I got it. I got it. John has it. We have to move this down. We gotta move this up. Too far. Fuck. That's too far that way. Alright, hell, we'll try it. We'll try it. You know, what do we have to lose? Oh, hell yes. Open sesame. That's a nice little homage. I like that. Crash Boondicoot. <laughs> Is Boo scary? Yeah. You know it's funny. You know it's funny. Oh, hello. And hello, Mr. Crow's Head. Yeah, fuck 
fuck it, I'll just power through them. Hey. Dude, if I get all 20 on my first pass on this level, I'm gonna give myself a big old pat on the back. Well, hello there. What are you doing up there? Oh, absolutely nothing. Okay. Hey, there's a crow's head. Ah, we got five more to go, so we're at perfection. Oh no! Pumpkin Jack, quit not grabbing that ledge. You grab that ledge, sir. There you go. You go, sir. Shut up, man. It was a lot funnier the first time. Wise cracking, wise cracking crow, you. First of all, here's number 16. Second of all, I know how to get to number 17 now. We're gonna backtrack it. Hell yeah. There it is. Boom, 17. Third of all, holy shit, I have no idea what to do from here. Hey, there we go. Shit. 
find one more after that and we will have all 20 crow scrolls in this level hell yes <laughs> it by one. Oh, man. Man, you know, as the nostalgia critic review of The Mummy would say. All right, boss fight. Let's do it. <laughs> Who goes there? Show yourself. There. There he is. Kaka. Yes, just as always, my thing as always. Don't be so craven. It's just an old stranded scarecrow. Did he see me? Please tell me he didn't see me. <laughs> well, look who's here. Back for more fun, little birdie. Ah, he saw me. Flee, flee, flee. <laughs> Stop wetting yourself. As for you, it's time you hopped away. <laughs> I heard you were skulking around here, Jack. <laughs> Dim-witted monsters, not cutting it for the old man. Ah. I have my own business, Scarecrow. If you don't get out of my way, I won't mind turning you into kindling. <laughs> So to do our jobs for us. Well, we'll show him all you humans are good for, living or dead. I'll bury you again, you wretch. Shit, an item. Uh, do I? I think it's glitched. 
glitched out. Oh, fuck. <clears throat> no! <clears throat> oh, no! It's glitched out! It's glitched out! Maybe if I go this way, it'll... No! Oh, fuck. No! It's glitched out! <laughs> Uh-oh. That's not good. I missed a crow's skull at some point, and it would also appear that I cannot complete this level. So, yes, I will have to return to the main menu, and then we will have to load that game. Hopefully it doesn't glitch again. Come on. Hey, that time we got it. I might have just been able to press triangle before, I'll be honest. I didn't try that. Stingy Jack, the genius trickster who could fool even the devil himself, has returned to the mortal realm. Armed with a brand new body and his soul cruelly bound to a festering pumpkin, Jack has been joined by his stoic guide, the Owl, and commandeered the services of a cowardly crow to fight on his behalf. But there must be no more time for fun and games. Jack and his companions of the night must embark upon their quest to slay the wizard. With Jack now perfectly attuned to his new vessel, the owl leads him to the mountains in the distance. Oh shit. We're at the heart of the mountains, through a network of ancient mines. The dragon smell. Okay, maybe not him, but other people. We'll be right back. I'll go to the bathroom and then I'll be right back.
let's continue. <laughs> Dude, this, I gotta say, this is the perfect Halloween game. this I can switch it's a fun game why are more people talking about this what's going on Obviously more simplistic. It's less. I'm not even gonna say it's less atmospheric. It's like it's simpler, but I wouldn't say it's any less atmospheric. I know I'm saying that word weird. I don't know why. Atmospheric. Uh, I feel like I'm putting the emphasis on the so The point is, it's a fantastic game. It has a lot of atmosphere.
speak to that. Oh. My god, I'm pretty sure this pumpkin shit gives me the shits, but I just keep taking it regardless. painful at times, you toughen up. Yes, I just compared those two, that's how sad I am. Alright. Mr. Crow, what's up with you? Oh, shit. Head. I feel like this is blatantly copying, uh, uh, what the fuck is it called? Um, Daxter. It's copying Jack and Daxter. Let's just get this as close as we can so that we can avoid a similar fate as last time. Oh god, I'm pushing it further away. Hey, we got it. Oh no! Okay, the bomb stayed, so we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. the bomb up here. This is some bullshit. Yeah, of course. We're fine. Diagonally. Explosive. Hey, fuck you. Woo! Hell yeah. <laughs> Yeah, fuck you, you 
batty bastard. It's the mine card. That's always a thing in platformers. Oh shit. Tilting the camera on me every which way. That wasn't nice. That was uh, borderline unfair. Hey, it's 
it's just because I'm drunk, but I feel like that's unfair. Hey, a crow skull, 8 out of 20. Let's get up here. Dude, I love this music. Expensive costume. Yeah, unless they pull some last minute bullshit on us and give us a new costume to buy. We should be okay. Holy shit, it's not even two. There's no fucking way I'm making it to three. See a crow's head down there. Oh my god. 
Ash doing the same bullshit over and over is killing me. Oh my gosh. Apparently so oh my gosh, I oh. Sleep deprivation in this. Oh, come on, uh, fucking skeleton, fucking jack o' lantern. Oh, shit. Fuck. Okay, we're gonna have to call it quits there for tonight. Cannot stay up any longer. You guys have a good one. Till then, stay plus ultra. Boom.